to Coffee with Karishma. The aim of the show is to inspire somebody somewhere in some way or the other. Today on this show we have Janice who is a fitness freak who focuses on conquering the mind and the founder of Absolute Focus. I am so excited to be here today <laughs> because we literally just met two weeks ago, three weeks ago, Seriously. Yeah. and we just clicked. Totally. <laughs> so hello Janice and welcome Hi. to Coffee with Karishma. Thanks for having me. By the way, I absolutely love, yeah. love, love the name Absolute Focus. Right. Ab Focus. I'm so glad you got it right away. How smart. I mean, seriously. <laughs> so glad Absolute you got Focus it. in the mind. Yeah. Ab Focus in the Amazing. core. Amazing. So, okay, well, so. for sure I know that my strength is the core, the abs, because um, you could see it actually. <laughs> And it just ties in to the mindfulness, like yeah. absolute focus. Yeah. It just ties in like together perfectly. Yeah. It just basically explains everything, the mission, the vision that I have for absolute focus. Yeah. Because I think that body and mind, when they're aligned, it's it does amazing things. Yeah. Because if your body is just not there, like your body is always there. <laughs> if your mind is not if there. If your mind is not there, my mind is not here right now. <laughs> absolute focus on everything your body and mind has to be there you have to be present yeah so yeah. that you can give your 100 so how my class works is that every time i start i start with a mini meditation like the mountain pose like a century so you were there i was you there were. you killed me you absolutely the meditation part me. didn't kill you I, yeah except for the meditation <laughs> the later i was like a turtle trying to like get myself off like i was but it was great. I really, really enjoyed it. Yeah, so basically, yeah. like, centering yourself first for the five minutes because a lot of people, we're in Hong Kong, everyone rush here to yeah. there. It's oh, really, like, the weather is so warm and oh, humid. Yeah. It's so hard for it's you too much to just, on. yeah, be calm and center yourself. So every time when I start my class for three minutes, I would just start with a simple like, meditation. Just med centering yourself. Yeah. Basically, just say centering, yeah, centering yourself. Put your mindful focus to the class and I just tell my students to say okay just close your eyes enjoy the breeze because it's at Central Pier 9 or Tamer Park sometimes and just breathe in the fresh air and just relax. You know what's really beautiful is that I've, I've seen that some people either they go hardcore mm -hmm. you know they go extreme physical body and get that goal get those abs and it's really physical yeah or it's like yoga which both are beautiful. Yeah. Personally, I, I can't really do yoga because I find that I'm a very rushed person. I do like running. I do like dancing. Awesome. I love need to. It. I need that. But the balance. So I've tried yoga so many times that I'm like, all right, this is too. I just need to get out. I need to do something. Yeah. So I, what I really like about it, it's it's a good balance because I also do really like meditating. I do like centering myself. I, there's so much power in just centering yourself. I call it centering yourself. I don't like to call it meditation because yeah. I don't really know what meditation is. But um, I like to center myself. I like to sit down and just collect my energy and just sit down. Yes, yeah, so and that is what it's like. That's what, what it I is. And you're just combining both, which yeah. basically means body and mind and, and soul, yeah. really. Like so just putting why it all together. I think that meditation, well, the first part of centering yourself is important because I've been through a phase where I'm physically capable of doing things, but my mind's not there. Yeah. For example, um, I just went to a lot of spinning classes. Yeah. Now I go to a lot of the Pilates class. Yeah. And I I wasn't there. Like during that time I wasn't feeling mentally well. And I'm like doing the workouts. I'm like spinning, but you're not feeling it. Something is something's not missing. something's missing. I wasn't there. And I sometimes I just forget things. Like I just forget to get my dumbbells for spinning where I always go to the class why all of a sudden I forgot that you're not mindful exactly I completely lost my mindfulness time yeah so basically I was kind of detached from my soul <laughs> from so my that's body. what that's what you got. that's, that's the, the core yeah. of, of that focus. that's exactly it's it's putting those that's two together why I make sure that people in my class they would find the focus yeah and also when you're doing Pilates you're working your muscles you need to know how your body feels. If you don't, you if you're not mindful enough to know what kind of muscles you're working on, then it's so hard for you to build that muscle. It's so beautiful how you've taken your entire kind of like 
you, your life experience, and your, your passion for, for exercise yeah. and fitness, and just put it all together into app focus, I actually really find it beautiful because I truly believe there's only one of you, there's only one of everybody <laughs> in the world, yeah. and everybody has the right ingredients to be them. Mm -hmm. Nobody else can be more you than you. Well, thank you so much. You've definitely inspired me. And I hope she's inspired you guys out there because it was such a beautiful conversation just speaking to you and um, just knowing what you're doing, how you're doing it. And um, definitely keep our eyes on you. Um, go Hold to me accountable, guys. <laughs> it's At so easy to com. lose my focus, even though I'm the founder of Absolute Focus. I am a person who gets distracted very easily. So yeah, but no, you have committed yourself to Ab Focus, and yeah. that keeps your focus. Yeah, right? and I know my purpose of life, and I know my vision and my mission. <laughs> mission and mission. Wait, so, so yeah. abfocus.com is that correct? Yep, abfocus.com. Yeah. So check her out on abfocus.com and Instagram. Apps focus. Apps focus. <laughs> Absolutely. Facebook, absolute focus, but facebook.com slash apps focus. Everything um, apps focus. All right. Well, I'll put the apps links focus. down below so you can contact her directly or want to speak to her or just just keep an eye on her because yeah. she's doing great, 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 I phenomenal write and things. I teach. So if you want to come to my class, it will be every Sunday, 10 to 11 a.m. Central Pier 9 Central or Tamar Park. Park. Yes, Tamar Park. You can Park. see all the details on Instagram and Facebook. Yeah, It's a beautiful experience, by the way. Been there, done that. Beautiful, beautiful experience. <laughs> so yeah, definitely go check out. And thank you so much for thank watching you. Coffee with Karishma. I had so much fun this episode. <laughs> Super inspired. And I hope someone out there, one of you, is inspired as well because that's the whole purpose of this show. So thank you for watching Coffee with Karishma and we'll catch you next Yay. week.